Now, like triglycerides, we hear people talk about them all the time. What are they? They're fat. Where do they come from? Fat? No, they come from carbohydrates. The liver manufactures triglycerides from carbohydrates. So it's the carbohydrates that are the problem, leading to increases in this blood fat. Triglycerides. Most doctors have no clue of this. They think it is a fat, comes from fat, and that's not true. So, if you've got elevated triglycerides, that indicates that you're eating many too many carbohydrates. That's a major, major problem. Now, the other outcome of eating these carbohydrates will be an elevation in insulin levels. And it was as early as 1949 that insulin was implicated in the development of cardiovascular disease. But this was virtually ignored, and it's still ignored today, while we lay all the blame on cholesterol and fat. So it's carbohydrates and insulin that create the problems. Now, what else do these two bad news bears do? They lead in the formation of glycated proteins. So the glucose binds to the proteins that make up your body, including your blood vessels. That glycated protein binds to the one next to it, and next to it, and so on, and your body actually becomes glued together. You lose your elasticity in those blood vessels, you lose it in your lungs, you lose it in the membranes of your brain, you lose elasticity everywhere, and these glycated proteins also form what we call reactive oxygen species, which are free radicals, and they damage cell membranes. Importantly, they damage the mitochondria, which is the energy powerhouse inside the cell that produces the energy we need for our life processes. So the misinformation continues to abound, fed to us by the medical establishment and the scientific establishment. And it completely overwhelms me how these people cannot get their facts straight. I don't know how they miss all this. It, it's amazing. But it's what's happening. So do something different. Think differently. Pay attention and improve your health. I'm Dr. Greg Ellis.